Okay, uh, let's now get some fractions. Today I want to do show you how to find add some fractions with the unlike denominators and when our answer is improper. So therefore, I'm going to have two fractions. One is 5, 6. And remember, that just means my whole is going to be broken up into six equal parts. And I'm going to select five of them. One, two, three, four, five. And then 1 half means my whole bar is going to be broken into two parts. And I'm going to select one of those. And don't worry about how many. I'm just selecting uh, that half. So when I want to add 5, 6, and 1 half, remember, whenever we're adding fractions, we have to make sure our denominator, the bottom of our fraction, is exactly the same. So I need to look at and say, all right, what multiples, what number can I get for 6 and 2 to be exactly the same? And what I notice is that 2 and 6 share the same multiple of 6 meaning 6 goes into 6 one time, and 2 goes into 6 three times. So to get 2 to be 6, I need to multiply it by 3. I need to multiply 6 by 1, but I don't need to write that out. But remember, to, I need to keep these equivalent fractions. So I need to multiply the top and the bottom by 3. Therefore, now what I'm going to have is 5, 6 plus 1 half. Well, um, now what I'll have is, I'm sorry, 5, 6 equals okay, plus 3 over 6. Well, that's going to leave me 8, 6. So if I break up my fraction bar, right? remember, the denominator tells you how equally to set it up. And so I'm going to have, and then the parts tell you how, the numerator tells you how many you're going to select. Well, now I have 8. So I have 6 here, and I need to create 8. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create an extra two more boxes. And this is what we call an improper fraction. And this is the way I'm going to have you leave your answers in this video. Um, but what you just want, I just want you to notice that you're improper because you have more parts than one whole. So let's look at another example. And I'll try to quickly go through this one. Uh, 3 eighths plus 7 ninths. To add these, I've got to get them to be the same denominator. So what I'm going to do is multiply um, by 9 over 9 and by 8 over 8. Because what I recognize is the common denominator between 9 and 8 is 72. And I have to make sure I multiply by the same number to keep equivalent fractions. Therefore, I now obtain 27 over 72 plus 56 over 72. I can now add, and what I obtain is 83 over 72. And what you'll notice again is we're going to have more parts than in the whole. But that's OK. It just means it's going to be an improper fraction meaning that we're going to have more parts than our, um, than our whole can kind of create. Um, and that's about it, ladies and gentlemen, for uh, adding fractions with unlike denominators and getting improper answers.